Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Rich Side. So today is a really good luck day, so I think we will try to go mining maybe. Also it's raining so we don't even need to water, so perfect mines day. So I think in this episode we're going to be completing the minecarts, which I'm so excited. We've got two sets of minecarts to complete. I think we need a bunch more gold smelted in order to do that. So I think I'm going to bring the furnace with us whilst we go to the mines. I'm also going to check on our animals quickly. Oh, this is ready to harvest as well. But yeah, I'm going to check on our animals see how they're doing oh we got some mayos we've got a large egg as well nice i should really upgrade this coop soon we still got a bunch of eggs in here as well also i do have a new mic so i hope the mic quality is decent i'm still playing around and trying to get used to it it's an upgrade so hopefully it sounds better okay will we need anything with us at the mines i think i'm just gonna leave that behind do we need any extra food i could bring some autumn's bounties i guess we're doing the bottom levels of the mine with the rubbish pickaxe so it's gonna be a little bit painful but that's okay right let's head off let's sell the mayos and then head off to the mines Oh, I should have bought my hoe. There's some worms on the floor. It's always annoying when you forget your hoe. <laughs> and there's more worms right here too, just to spite me. Let's put the furnaces down up here and we'll put on the gold ore as well. So hopefully these will just smelt as we're going through the mines. We'll just keep popping up every time we get to the next five floors. We'll pop up and put some more on. I'm saying that as if we can get through like loads of floors today. I highly doubt we can, to be honest, because uh, we're on the bottom levels. It's going to take us ages to breakthrough oh my gosh i just wanted to get the aquamarine why must you do this please get gone yeah i'm i'm talking as if we're gonna get through loads of floors today i don't think we will actually because we're quite weak <laughs> this is definitely not easy kind of hate it i might die right now <laughs> oh my gosh lil let's not be so confident hey i've really thrown myself in usually i like start the first day of an episode like quite casual quite relaxed today i've decided no i'm just gonna throw myself in the deep end and go straight to the bottom floors of the mine that's a great idea it takes like 10 hits to get a rock broken oh my gosh okay i'm exaggerating slightly it's like five but still that's five too many in, in my opinion <laughs> okay i actually am weak i actually am weak i don't think i can do this i genuinely don't know what to do i think i need to upgrade my pickaxe i'm gonna end up dead i really am this is not good at all it kind of gets floor 85 even i kind of want to push myself but also probably regret it we're like 83 though so it'd be kind of sad to go now i should have at least bought bombs what was i thinking where is the ladder been stuck on this floor for like a year i feel again i am exaggerating slightly <laughs> i tend to do that just a little bit okay finally we got the ladder oh and a freebie okay it redeemed itself it redeemed itself we got to 85 oh that'll do me that'll do me i think okay we can go back home and smelt the rest of these bars i don't know if we had enough bars i think we must have we needed 10 do we definitely have 10 bars because we also needed a spare bar for the community center as well i'm wondering if we actually have enough i'm a little bit worried because we've only got two more to smelt i don't know how many we had in our chest yeah we have six in here so we have nine left and then we can smelt two more which i think is just about enough right we need one bar for the community center and then 10 for the other minecarts so yeah we literally just about have enough that worked out pretty well then let's put on another strawberry jam say hello to our kitty okay well we wasted all our energy in the mines so we can't really do much now maybe i should just like clear up the farm a little bit i should harvest this wheat actually and i can get some more seeds eventually too let's harvest the wheat so i think we needed this for the fodders bundle i think i need more actually because i think it needed 10 maybe so i'll have to buy some more wheat seeds tomorrow i should have done that today really but we can do that tomorrow that's fine okay today still managed to somehow be kind of an unproductive day i think i'm just gonna go around and forage at the beach and stuff we have the merchant in town i should definitely go check her out i might do that first actually let's go to the traveling merchant and see if she's got any good gifts. Hello, do you have anything good for me? There's ice cream, coconut. Oh, stuffing, isn't that a loved item? Oh, an ancient seed. Ooh, I might buy the ancient seed. I think I'm gonna. Let's do it. That's actually a really good find, I can't lie. We have one growing already, I think, but it was only 400, so I think that was quite a bargain. Okay, now let's go to the beach and just forage for a little bit. I should really have bought my hoe. <laughs> There's nothing but worms here. Okay, we got a bunch of forage we can sell. Now let's head to the saloon, see what's happening in the saloon today. Hi, Bert. The missus and I sometimes fight, and it's a real hassle, but it's nothing some love and comfort fix. Okay, Bert. <laughs> nice insight to your marriage there. Okay. Is there anyone new here who isn't vanilla? Not really. Only Bert comes. Interesting, he's friends with Clint and Willie. No one new is really there. Oh, I could, I guess, check with Gus what he'd sell him. 
<gasps> rhubarb pie should i buy it what are we saving for i shouldn't we need our money don't we that looks delicious though i wonder if floor would like it i'm trying to be sensible and see what we need to invest our money into you know speaking of what we want to invest our money into i kind of want to decorate this area so i might need to buy a couple of recipes from robins i don't think i've done that yet right oh wait we did get some we've got the lamppost and the stepping stone path i kind of want to decorate this area a little bit with that also a tub of flowers would look really cute out here i think i want to encompass the whole pond area so we might have to have fencing going all the way down here perhaps Oh, we have loads of forage on our own farm. Okay, so somehow it managed to get kind of late. Even though we weren't really doing much, I'm going to sell this forage that we found. And then I'll plant the ancient seed and then we can head to bed. I'm going to plop that down there. Oh, maybe I should put it with some fertilizer as well. Do we have any fertilizers? We have speed grow. I could do it with some speed grow. Let's try it. And the gold bars are done. So we've literally completed all the gold bars we need, which is kind of amazing, honestly. I'm so glad we've done that. So now we're going to have minecarts in both areas. Okay, we made like a grand. Still not good money. Our watering can is ready. Perfect. We need to go and pick that up before we water today. Wow, because we can't water otherwise. Let's also put some more copper on. Because then we can upgrade our pickaxe at some point soon hopefully and i'm gonna bring some gems just in case we run into people up in ridge side oh we got a little pepper grown here and we got three large eggs today nice i can sell all this mayo i might sell it straight to pierre since we're going to his anyway we need six more wheat seeds to go along there and then we'll go and pick up our watering can too but first we can donate our gold bar and finish the bundle in the community center okay time to donate the gold bar i'm really excited i think this is our first bundle it is it's gonna be the first bundle we completed okay Oh wait, we have the fire quartz as well. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Take me home. I need to grab the fire quartz. Oh my gosh, what a melon. Right, I'll pick that up and then we'll do this. I'll reconvene when I've got the fire quartz. I'm sorry, everyone. Okay, I'm back with the fire quartz. Oops. Okay, we've got the gold bar. <laughs> Bundle complete. What did we get from this? Oh, we got a furnace. Nice. That's always helpful. And fire quartz. It's done. And we got some omni geodes. Nice. It's done. Oh my gosh, look at it. Oh, all the Janamos. Our first bundle done. We are the Janamos, keepers of the forest. They're so cute. It's done, everyone. Look at it. Oh my goodness. Our first bundle, it only took us till summer to complete, but we won't focus on that. It's done. That's all that matters, right? Now let's go and sell to Pierre and then we'll go and pick up our watering can. Please, can you buy my mayos? and my hot pepper and i need to buy six wheat seeds from you thank you do you have anything else that's nice not really that's quite cute oh oops i genuinely didn't mean to do that i know you're not gonna believe me but i really did not mean to click that <laughs> but i'm kind of glad i did i should have bought the copper to upgrade my pickaxe oops but we got our watering can that's all that matters right okay let's head back to the farm and water all of our crops oh i could open my omni geodes whilst i'm here although I've got no space in the inventory do i so much back and forth today honestly oh kenneth's up his ladder again good job kenneth okay it's already midday let's speed water oh what am i doing i can water in three now <gasps> look at me let me also plant these wheat seeds too honestly this free tile watering can is more hassle than it's worth it's so hard to get in the right position or maybe i'm just really bad at it but this is so hard <laughs> finally right let's go <laughs> and donate these gold bars it's already 3 p.m and we're only just heading up to ridgeside that took us way too long <gasps> floor's here floor's here let's give her the rugla i think she likes this Oh no, we've already gifted her two gifts this week. Hi there. How's the fun, Lil? Be careful not to overwork yourself. God, she's properly talking to me now. Oh God, do you want a strawberry? Thanks, I suppose. What? Why does no one like strawberries? Hi, would you like a mountain arugula? This is useful. Thanks a lot. I think I just need to keep gifting everyone, honestly. Would you like a sweet pea? Thank you. This is generous of you. Would you like a frozen tear? You're so kind. Thanks. I'm excited to donate the bars. Okay, 10 gold bars and it's done. Oh my gosh, we finished it. Okay, what do we get from it? Perhaps we get the cutscene tonight. Well, we did it. Nothing happened, but we did do it. Evelyn, Evelyn. No, not Evelyn. What's your name? Lola. She liked the amethyst. You look a little tired, dear. That is so rude, Lola. You don't say that to people. I recommend the hotel if you're looking for a little R&R. &R. Rest and recuperation. Ah, oh, very close, very close. Uh, that means rest and relaxation. I just learned that the other day. Let's give you a quartz. This is dope, thanks. And Bert liked the jade, right? Oh, we've already given Bert two gifts. Would you like an aquamarine? He likes that, doesn't he? Let's give this to Faith. Oh my, I can't thank you enough. Oh, she really liked that. Yawn. Good morning, Lil. I'm not much of a morning person. I mean, 
babes, it's 5.30 p.m. (laughs) Or an afternoon person. I do my best to work at night, usually after a nice snack. Let's give you a topaz. This is nice, I guess. Thanks. What do you want now? Huh? How am I? Fine. Why do you care? Okay. (laughs) He's not the easiest to befriend, is he? Okay, what are they selling? Ooh, farmer's lunch. That could be pretty useful. That looks nice. I want all of these things. Is it the same on this side? Oh, this is the recipes. I really want to buy these things, but they're so expensive. (laughs) I guess we'll wait a little longer until we're making a bit more money. Although that one's quite cheap. What if we just slipped and bought it? Like that? Oops, did not mean to do that. (laughs) Definitely was an accident. That time it wasn't an accident. The first time it was, okay? Oh, Lola wants us to slay some slimes. I can definitely do that. Let's head back home. I really want to make some fencing and stuff to go around our coop. I might add some trees around that area too. That might look cute. Okay, we have 68 wood, so we're not exactly rolling in it, but we can um, see what we can do, I guess. Let's make as much as we can for now. I'll grab like 20 and I'll also do some wooden paths to go underneath. I kind of want some trees to be planted around as well. Since it's forest farm, we want to keep it looking quite foresty. Okay, so I'll plant some trees around here. I'll just start to put the fencing down here, I think. And then the tree will grow there. That will look pretty cute. And then... And maybe over this side as well, we'll just like bring the flooring down and then we'll put the fence on top. I don't know where the gate should go. Maybe at the top here? Maybe like there? We can make a little gate here. Oh my gosh, you need 10 wood. I don't have enough. I need to knock down some trees real quick. Where are the trees at? Oh, we've cleared the whole farm, didn't we? Oh no, I need trees. I didn't really want to do this in the dark because you can't see what I'm doing. I also want to grab a couple of stepping stones. Put the little fence down. Okay, that's kind of a cute start. And then we'll just have the fence like come in all the way down here and around the pond, I think. Most of their enclosure will be a pond, unfortunately. But the ducks will like it when we get ducks, finally. You can't really see what I've done, but in the daylight, I'll show you. (laughs) And we'll keep this path going up here. Okay, let's head to bed. Didn't get too much done again <laughs> oh my gosh we've got the minecart now done look at the little janimos that's so cute okay we didn't get a cut scene for the ridgeside one so i wonder how that will play out i guess we'll find out maybe it didn't work because we did two in one day i don't know but we made no money so that's kind of embarrassing honestly <laughs> oh we have a recipe and the merchants in town again so we're definitely going to check that out i definitely should have done my pickaxe because we've got another bad luck day maybe i'll go and upgrade the pickaxe today but knowing me we'll have good luck tomorrow <laughs> and i won't be able to go mining We definitely need to go mining as well because we have like no ore left at this point. That was our last bar that we could make. It's definitely not a good time to be giving in my pickaxe, but it's fine. Okay, that was painstaking to water, but at least it's done. And all my chickens have ignored my fencing, so I definitely need to enclose it a little bit more. Then they won't be able to get out. We'll do that today for sure, but it's looking quite good. I mean, it's a little bit flat. It would be nice if it like dipped in and out. Maybe it's a bit straight here. Maybe I'll add some trees into it and stuff too, like we did on the other side oh my gosh we haven't even donated a large egg yet what i didn't know we hadn't donated those i've just been making them into mayo oh my gosh lil wake up i feel like i'm very behind in this playthrough especially in the community center i want to go and upgrade the pickaxe now and i'm definitely going to donate these eggs is there anything else we need to donate as well let me check through my chests i'm also going to open these geodes up i think that might be a good idea we need to donate the oak resin and the purple mushroom we've got these to donate to the us, but we think we need a little bit more first and we need to donate this okay that seems like everything let's donate first i think since otherwise i'll probably accidentally sell it or something okay we've got the common mushroom we've got the two large eggs and i think the rest of them are in the bulletin bundle got the purple mushroom and the oak resin perfect we made a lot of progress on the community center today then got our mayo to sell and now over to clint's hi clint can we process some geodes first Okay, we've got some stuff that we can go and donate to Gunther. And we've got a couple more to open. And then we'll upgrade our pickaxe. We've barely donated anything, I feel. Yeah, look how empty this is. (laughs) Let me sell this, the Calakite. Apparently we've donated that already and we'll process the rest. Oh, we got Iridium. Only one piece though, unfortunately. Okay, we've done those and now we just need to upgrade our tool. Let's go for the copper pickaxe, please. I love being absolutely poor. Got a couple more blue things to donate. Oh, we got a new reward. Nice. Oh, we got a star fruit seed. We can plant that. Right, let's go and chop some wood now. I want a bunch of wood so we can decorate our farm a little bit more because we have neglected decorating so much. Oh, there's a train. 
but we all know how I feel about trains. I hate them. I think they're useless and you never get anything good from them. You always like sweat trying to run up to the train station in Stardew and you get nothing from them. So I always ignore that little notification. Thanks game, but no thanks. I didn't know I felt so much sass towards the train, but apparently I do. Okay, that should be enough wood for now to be fair. Also, I want to plant this little star fruit seed with maybe a bit of speed grow as well. It's not really going to fit in our grid, although I could get rid of this because that died clearly. So I'm going to put a bit of speed grow down with our little star fruit. Okay, I think it looks all right. It's a little bit like boxy. I'm just wondering if we should like bring it out maybe around here. Do we get the fence back? Oh, we don't get the fence back. That's so sad. I think you only get it back if you place it that day, right? This might be too much though. I don't know if it will look good or bad. I just don't know. I wonder if I can get rid of this now. Oh, I can. I really don't know if this is going to look better or worse, to be honest. But it's done. I can also get rid of some of these bushes because they're very in the way. And I might also plant a couple more trees just around the edges as well. And obviously we'll have like some grass starters in here. It will look nice, I hope. I'm going to make some more stepping stone paths as well. Okay, I've also just enclosed this area. I don't know if I'll keep it like this. It looks a little bit thin and long. I might want to widen it out a little bit eventually, like have it go up till maybe one more tile, to be honest. But I can't change it now because I don't have my pickaxe. But we've made a little bit of an improvement to our farm, which is nice. Let's head to bed now. And it's the next day. We didn't make any money, which is just perfect. Just peachy. Yeah, I think I definitely want it to come out one more, perhaps. But it's looking kind of cute. I don't know if we'll keep this layout forever, but it's cute for now. And we've got the little enclosure down here for the chickens. It's looking kind of interesting. I don't know if I love this fencing, but it works, I guess. But I do think that's where I'm going to wrap up. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this part and I will see you in the next one. Bye, everyone. <laughs>